is going on you lot? Welcome to the video. Oh my god, this is a little bit wet. It's actually raining. I thought I'd come out here and film some stuff, but turns out I've just come out and now it's raining. So it's currently two o'clock on Wednesday and I'm about to meet with Liz, who is a lady from Click Sergeant. Uh, she's the lady I go on about quite a lot because she's helped me so much, um, helped me massively in the past. I'm about to meet with her, discuss how things are going. Basically we discuss like, you know, and I think the scariest thing is that, that they call this like end of life care. Whoa, no. That shit scares me. Um, I do not, I am not calling it end of life care. I'm just calling it a bit of support, you know, a bit, bit of support. Well, that is Liz all done with the meeting. Very good, she's, very, she's amazing. We just chat. You know, I didn't actually think I'd need support, but clearly I do. And now I'm gonna tuck into this melon. Aisha's losing weight and she's happy about it and I'm not because I wanted to build muscle and I wanted to build weight. If I want to lose fat. Yeah, lose fat, gain muscle, that's what we're doing. Yeah, that's what we're doing. So we're going to go to Waitrose to go and get some dinner. I might just get that roll I had last night. Yeah. Is no. that really bad? No, there's a cake. Literally, we're going to eat the cake as well. All I want... It's not Friday, we can only get it on Friday. Oh, I'm getting it for me then. I'm gonna get the cake all for me and then see if she has a bit. <laughs> well, obviously I will. Nice. Alright. So check out this mama for the dinner. I'm, I'm gonna go for it. I've got about 800 calories to hit and this is what I'm having. Two pizzas, all with chicken, olives and spinach in. So make sure chicken on the side, olives and some pot chips. All still healthy and low fat, but you know, it's like, that is what I fancy at the minute. So I'm gonna make it happen and have that probably most nights from now on. going on your lot it is thursday morning i can't even think straight i've just woken up and i'm like what is going on so i'm gonna have a shower and see if that kind of wakes me up a bit and sorts my head out Ugh. because i'm not feeling great see you after the shower right so we've had a shower i'm actually feeling shut up Scale of one to ten before the shower, I was feeling like a three. I'm actually feeling about a seven or an eight right now. Amazing what shower can do. So we're gonna chill for a bit. I'm gonna upload some footage on my laptop. And um, today, I think I'm waiting for a call from my nurse. I need meds. I'm running low on everything. Ah, and I need meds for tomorrow because I'm going to work. So hopefully she'll reply. If not, I need to give her a call and I need to pop into London and pick them up. Struggling to get hold of Peter. This could be a little bit of a a disaster as usual i need to i need to get into a routine of getting my meds at a certain point at a certain time and uh not failing so far i keep failing so i've just taken some of this and it, the, 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 the taste is fucking awful um but i've just started back on a new uh, cannabis oil uh and it's from cbd brothers my um, friend hooked me up with this, Gem, thank you so much. She told me, she informed me that the one from Holland Barrett is not legit. It's not, you know, because I can't really sell like, actual marijuana extract in Holland Barrett, which totally makes sense. Like, uh, mug. So I'm going to try this one instead. I'm only starting off with two drops. I figured out, and I, I've put, I'm putting it down to, the last time I tried this cannabis oil, I went too hard too soon, so I was taking too many drops, which is making me feel awfully sick. I, I was waking up like, I, mean, I, know, I look horrendous right now, but I don't really care. You lot have seen me at my worst and you lot have seen me at my best. But yeah, so I'm taking this. I'm starting off with two drops. I'm a, a little bit nervous about it because it made me feel so ill last time. That's why I stopped it. But I'm, I'm up for taking this one. I'm up for trying this new one. It's just awful taste. But I want to eat. I've lost a little bit of weight again, so I want to eat. I've got 15 minutes until I can eat. Just going to try and ring Peter. To see uh, if we can hook some drugs up. Get some drugs. I'm going to ring my drug dealer to get some drugs. Uh, just got an email from Peter, so we are on to get the meds today, which is great because I need them. And um, also, I'm trying this new Quaker Oats protein porridge. 
which is pretty good. It's pretty good. Is it? Is it? It's an easier way for me to get my protons in. I'm just gonna sit down and talk to the camera for a bit before I go and do anything else because a uh, cookie. So basically, I'm just I'm just gonna get the camera out because um, I'm feeling just so depressed. I'm feeling just the pain is back and um, it's just horrible. And also like my breathing is affected. Everything's affected. Like I'm, you could sit there and think oh, my breathing is affected. Oh my god, it's in my lungs like again. But like when I'm in this state of mind, I just need to go out. I just need to. I just need to go out. I need, I need to be surrounded by people that are that that look like they're not in the same situation as me. That they, they, they don't look like they've got any worries. You know, well some people do, but when you're out and about, surrounded by people like you can commuters and they're just going about their day to day life, and that's exactly what I'm doing. I don't have to stop because I've got cancer, even though sometimes it makes me stop because I feel physically sick and drained. I think this whole meeting with Liz is just kind of... It, it, nothing against her or the meeting, but, you know, people are worried. People are like, how do you want to go forward? And I just want to live my life. I don't want to... I'm not going to... I don't want to die yet. It's not ready for it. whether it's a CBD oil or what that is making me feel weird but something is fucking me up big time and it's making me feel super super depressed and drowsy and I think it might be that I don't know how you saw me earlier I'm feeling a little bit better but I'm not gonna lie I'm, things aren't still aren't great I'm gonna end the vlog here guys I'm South Kensington about to get my drugs and I'll pick up the camera straight away for the next video thanks for watching thanks for all your support you inspire me I love you all See you soon.